Saturday 48 Hours turns the spotlight on a scenario that's become all too familiar. Defending DJ is the story of grieving parents and their struggle to restore their son's reputation after he was shot dead by a police officer. CBS News special correspondent James Brown joins us live from Washington, D.C. with a preview. James, thanks for joining us. Maribel, thank you very much for having me. So, James, what, what made you decide to do the story? Maribel, to be honest about it, uh, my producer, Alvin Patrick, uh, was so um, uh, interested in this story because the family, the Henry family, uh, is an all-American family, and their son, DJ, uh, is one who could be anyone's son. As a matter of fact, in this bar broadcast, we'll take you through their seven-year journey in pursuit of the truth. And Maribel, certainly you know in this heated and divisive environment that we're in, the only thing that the, the parents were focused on in the entire family was just in finding out what the truth Truth is what happened. So after DJ was shot, what happened? Well, his friends who were in the car with him, uh, all fine young men, by the way, said that he was conscious when the car came to a stop and DJ commented, they shot me. Then the police pulled DJ out of the car, handcuffed him and laid him on the ground. And what you'll see in the dash cam video in the story tomorrow night is that uh, a cruiser arrives on the scene after DJ was shot and he wasn't receiving any medical attention at all for at least several minutes. So that was very disturbing video there. James Brown, looking forward to that as always. Thank you. Maribel, thank you so much. And you can watch 48 Hours right here on CBS4 Saturday night at 10. Then stick around for CBS4 News at 11. Here